Hi guys and welcome back and welcome back to the airfield where today we are drag racing once again. I get so excited for these videos. I know I always say that, but I generally do. More so because we are drag racing with my Audi R8 V10 Plus and a race I wanted to do for so long and we have finally made it possible. We are putting it up against a McLaren 570S. The comparisons are so similar with the McLaren being lighter, but the Audi R8, the launch is pretty impressive as well. But in the meantime, let me bring in Christian from BOTB, the man I am going up against. How you doing? <laughs> I'm ready. Good. Well, it's a, it's a draw so far, so all to play for today. It's all to play for, and you've come along in a McLaren 5 Yeah. <laughs> this, um, uh, this could go either way. You guys are the people who give away a car every single week. Every single week, yeah. Next week's pretty special. 400th winner next week as well on Tuesday. So That is crazy. It's Christmas. You're yeah. feeling generous. We're feeling very generous. Yeah, we've got £500 worth of dream car credit to give away. So we'll give that away in, in five lots. So £100 each. We'll give away five of those. And uh, yeah, somebody could be winning their dream car. You never know. You could even be the 400th winner. People, this is not a joke, have won a McLaren yep. on BOTB.com. Yeah. So, well, don't go and purchase that ticket yet. Let's wait to at the end to find <laughs> out which is quicker because at this point we don't know. Yeah, yeah. But I'm really looking forward to this. Are you ready? I'm ready. Good luck. Good so luck. Here we go. The Audi R8 V10 Plus up against a McLaren 570S. I have no idea at this point who is going to win. What I'm hoping here is that the Audi R8 gets a really good launch off the line because the McLaren being lighter, I feel that could be quicker in third to fourth gear. Let's roll up to the line for run number one. Come on! Performance mode is on. Are you ready? I think so. Three, two. Oh, I got it. I'm off. I'm off. I've got a better launch. I've got a better launch. I'm going. But the McLaren is coming back. Oh my God, I've got it back. This is going to be close. And then the McLaren was reeling me in, reeling me in, reeling me in. Oh, I think I got him just on the line. On the line. I mean, that was a, a dead heat. We should definitely go again. So we never usually do this, but we're just out of the car quickly after run number one <laughs> because my friend Luciano, who is a racing driver, who is the owner of this car, is warming the tyres up because yeah. you think this could help yeah, you out quite a lot. hundred percent. This is what's going to make me win. Look at this. Look at him warming it up. Whoa! <laughs> Let me introduce you to Luciano. Uh, Are the tyres warm now? Smell it. I can smell it. You reckon that will win now? Could do nothing more for you now. Before they get cold, come on, let's, let's go. go. I'm nervous now. I'm so worried at this point. Okay, you want to get going, don't you? McLaren got a much better launch because it's now warm than now I've lost. Ah oh boy. I know one way to get tyre temperature. Performance mode on and then full throttle. <laughs> right, I think I'm ready. Up to the line for the final launch. So it's one all in terms of launch controls. If I lose this and then the rolling start, let's be honest, it might not go in my favour. I'm done. Paddles up. I'm ready.
so much speed at like fourth gear, I just had nothing. That Audi's quite slow. <laughs> so there we have it. <laughs> well, that's it for the launches, but the rolling start's only gonna get worse for me. But that is interesting, isn't it? I honestly thought the Audi might have it and it didn't. <laughs> well, it did at the start. The first one I managed to win, uh, just about. But then it was when your professional racing driver Luciano managed to get temperature in the car it transformed it thank it? god for him yeah, I mean yeah. it transformed it it I mean let's be honest it still would have been close but the moment there was tire temperature in the McLaren I think it just it came into a league of its own yep. that's how close it was at the end <laughs> Jeez. that is what is that I mean let's be honest that is is that a car Swift uh, Half. three I'd say three quarters of a car half <laughs> <laughs> what we need to do now is we're going to do a rolling start if some of you are aware of these drag races we do a couple of launch controls and then we do a rolling start the rolling start we do 30 miles an hour to the white line at that point we go at that point i lose yeah, um, yeah. i was gonna say you might as well just go i might as well be in reverse <laughs> um but it is going to be interesting just to see just how much i mean sometimes the rolling starts surprise us and it's not as far as we think at that point so it will be interesting McLaren 570 up against the R8. Rolling start coming up. Time for the rolling start. Let's get these cars in position. This could be very, very depressing for the Audi R8. I'm gonna go to second gear, it's 20 miles an hour. Building up, 29, 30. There's nothing more I can do at that point. The McLaren just pulled away and pulled away. It's just got an extra bit over the R8. It really does. I mean, it wasn't night and day. Well, well it was, but that was two car legs. Maybe on a launch it was one and that is two. I would say two car legs at that point. Yeah. Do you want to even bother doing another one? No, that's it. That's it. <laughs> I will go home now and cry. I don't know what to say. I mean, that that car is really impressive. I yeah, mean, ballistically fast. When we turned up here, we had no idea who was going to win. If I was going to put money on anything, it would have been the R8. Yeah, definitely. Because I thought <laughs> it would have got off the line quicker. It's got more power. Yeah. I would have thought it would have just kind of pulled away, but no, I was seriously wrong. We had to bring in a professional racing driver. Let me bring in <laughs> the, the man himself. Come on. Thank you. Thank you for warming <laughs> you up the tires. Yeah, because he, I do. He did a, it made a big difference, didn't it? Yeah. I mean, the first run looked. Did you win the first run? I won the first run. Yeah. And then it all went wrong from there. Yeah. Um, and but then yeah, and, they, and then he I was warming the, the tires. I'm like, oh, 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 oh. <laughs> like this car was lucky to stay on the straight line. But then, and then that was it. And of course, you guys know BOTB. Yeah, only 16 or over to enter. You can play worldwide, uh, and we give away a car every single week. Tickets start from just one pound twenty-five, and uh, this week, pretty special, we're giving away five hundred pounds worth of dream car credit. So we'll give it to five lucky people, hundred pounds per person, and you could just be winning your dream car. It's Christmas. That's what we're doing. <laughs> it is Christmas, yeah. <laughs> and we want you guys, as always, to help us with recommendations, what we're going to do next. A massive thank you to Luciano, who bought down his McLaren for the day. I will leave all his social media details down below. Make sure you check out BOTB. All those details are down below, and your chance to win your car. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already, and I'll see you all next time.